Thank you for tuning to Smart's Instagram. Make sure you click the link in the bio. Like, subscribe. You know what to do. Uh, we appreciate the love. Make sure that you guys uh, click that thumbs up and subscribe button. We are really, really, really appreciate it. We're trying to get to a thousand um, subscribers. So uh, any help can any help would help. So <laughs> just like I say, subscribe, click the thumbs up. We appreciate the love. So uh, word in the street is Suge Knight killed Biggie Smalls. And from what they're saying, the target was Sean P. Diddy Combs. And this shit has been going on for a long time. Um, you know, there have been movies about this and how it's a cover up and how, you know, something ain't right, something wasn't adding up. Um, and it was pretty much an unsolved mystery. Like, people didn't really know who killed Biggie or why. Now, I think the person who uh, pulled the trigger is a guy named some Mac, M-A-C-K. I believe he, he's had some interviews where he said that he did um, pull the trigger. But now they're saying that he was the trigger man and that <clears throat> it was all set up by uh, Suge Knight. So, Suge Knight is definitely where he belongs behind bars um and now that this information has came to light i mean i know suge is 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 a, is a gangster and i know he that nigga but i don't know man motherfuckers loved biggie smalls man um and i would think that at this point in time diddy probably has just as much power as a as a Suge Knight does in jail, out of jail, to where he might be able to get Suge touched. Now, I'm not saying that, you know, I want anything bad to happen to Suge. What I'm just saying is, this is some gangster shit going on. And if you was to find out, like, I don't know if, I don't know if Diddy knew that uh, Suge set this shit up and it was Suge who was behind it all. And now that he knows, even though he's brother love and all that shit, I know if it was me, oh, I'd be sending some killers at him, for sure. I'd be definitely like, I'd be definitely on the horn like, yo, I need to know who we got in the joint that can take care of this nigga. Because, uh, mm -mm, hell no. No, sir. You are not getting away with that. Mm -mm. But at the same time, there's a lot of people who say Diddy was in on it, but... They're saying that the target was Diddy, so I don't know. I don't know if Diddy was in on it or not. And that's what I'm saying. Like, if I was if I was a gangster and I got word of this information, we got, you know, shit, should gotta get taken care of. So, you know, God forbid, I don't want anything to happen to Suge Knight. You know, we don't, you know, we don't want anything to happen to any of our brothers. But um, but yeah, man, you you put a hit out on somebody. And never, the shit never came out. Like, I'm, I'm guessing the only reason it came out now is because the nigga's in jail. I mean, seriously, like, I don't, I don't understand why this information never came out until now. Like, they've been had this information. So why is it just now coming out? But regardless, none of this out, what, what are the consequences and repercussions behind it going to be? And I think there are going to be some consequences and repercussions for Suge. I mean, I, but I don't know. I mean, we know Suge a gangster. Shit. So, he might, he might be untouchable. I don't know. But uh, I know it's fucked up that uh, he put a hit out and got Biggie killed. That's crazy. But that's this rap shit. So, you know, right now, the independent is the way to go. I wouldn't even think about being on the label, man. These niggas is crazy. Why would you fucking want to sign to somebody else's business or label? Nigga, start your own label. Start your own business. Be your, be your own boss. Don't work for none of these niggas, man. These niggas will kill you. As we can see. So, thanks for tuning in. Appreciate the love. Peace.